Dr. Baby, our day is finally here. I have been looking forward to this day and special moment with you for years. I can't begin to explain how excited I am that we will be married. Thank you so much for all of the work and time you put into making today beautiful and special. Thinking back on the five years together, the experiences we have shared, the memories we have made, and the time we have spent together makes my heart so full and happy. I'm so lucky to have you as my best friend and love of my life. Out of all the great things that have happened in my life, meeting and falling in love with you is easily the best. <laughs> I know that whatever life brings over our way, we will have a wonderful life together. I love you so much and I can't wait to see you. Love, Andy. My sister can overcome anything and come out stronger. And I have to think that Eric and I played a small role in this through our endless tormenting of her in our young childhood. This resilience has allowed her to seamlessly transition from an early focus in architecture and arts towards a rigorous catch up in the sciences. Dina is a guiding star in our family, a star that is so bright that it continuously shines on us to show us how blessed our family is. We are so proud of you every day and are so excited to see what your future has in store. All I know is that whatever you put your heart and mind to, you will succeed at like you always do. Andy has always been very curious um, and just all around really challenging. He loved to challenge us. He loved to really just make sure that things were quite fun. Andy, we love you. We are so proud of you, the brother, son, friend, and now husband to our sister, Dina. All of that to say, you two are absolutely crazy, and you are absolutely in love, and you have our love forever. Congratulations, Andy and Dina. May the celebration of your marriage today remind each of us the value of a true friend and always lead with love.
Andrew and Dina, have you come here freely and without reservation to give yourselves to each other in marriage? Yes. Will you love and honor each other as husband and wife for the rest of your lives? Would you accept children lovingly from God and bring them up according to the law of Christ and His Church? Since it is your intention to enter into marriage, join your right hands and declare your consent before God and His Church. I, Andrew. I, Andrew. Take you, Dina. Take you, Dina. To be my wife. To be my wife. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be true to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I will love you and honor you. I will love you and honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. I, Dina, take you, Andrew. I, Dina, take you, Andrew. To be my husband. To be my husband. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be true to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I will love you and honor you. I will love you and honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. And now it is my great honor to present to you as husband and wife, Andrew and Dina Perky, and on occasions such as these, it's appropriate to show our approval with our applause. We may kiss the bride. No one has ever seen God, but if we love one another, God lives in us and his love is made complete in us. My best wishes and prayers are with you always. Love you. Andy and Dina, we can only hope that your love for each other and your true friendship grow over the years that your uh, of your marriage. And that your marriage is like the positive side of arithmetic, full of addition and multiplication and without subtraction or division. We believe these few simple words are the cornerstone and we encourage you to embrace this. God's grace is sufficient. His love for us, Dina and Andy, is as much as is needed. It is enough. For the rest of our lives.